Hi guys, thanks for tuning in to another one. Um, been a little bit behind on uploads lately, but um, I've got a few in the tank, so bear with me while I uh, fire these ones out for you. So this time we're doing a cute little spring set. Um, I love, love, love pastels. I love this time of year. Everyone's starting to just dip into colour a little bit, aren't they? Um, don't know about you a lot, but I've been doing a crazy amount of pink and white. It's like all my clients want is French at the minute. Like, I cannot believe how much I'm doing French. It is unreal. It's seriously unreal. Um, so when my client come in and said, you want pastels? I was like, oh my God, yes, finally some colour. Um, so we're just going to do, um, beautiful multicoloured ombre. So I'm going to go through all the pastels. So we've got a cute little like a Tiffany blue green colour and then going on to a yellow one um, and then next I think we do like a bit of a shimmery pink which is quite cute I'm in a little bit of trouble with the end of that one as you can see but we'll get there, we'll make it work so yeah so glad to get a little bit of colour literally all my clients have in French so yeah I think this was the first colour set I've done in forever I'm like thank heavens for her walking in so you can see it's a redesign. I think it's practically an overlay now um, on this client because literally all my clients can have redesigned so it's just a case of whizzing back to that clear layer um, and then on with the next design. I've um, I've not infilled with clear on this set because I'm only going over with a really light nude. Um, so once I whiz back anyway, like we'll get rid of all that and it won't be an issue. That's a really nice, soft, subtle, light pink. And then I'm going to go in with a lilac, I think, if I can remember rightly. I'm sure it was a lilac. Right, as you can see, we're just dipping in it background there. <laughs> and how frustrating is that little bit of white gel on my thumb at the side look? When I read it in this video, I was like, oh my god, that's really bugging me. <laughs> I wish my nails looked like that now. This video is probably about two, three weeks old. Like, and my nails do not look like that I can assure you they look a right state I think when your nail takes the nice for about what a day two days maybe depending on what day you do on and then they're absolutely ruined it doesn't help that I went out at the weekend and I wore like a black outfit and all the dye has like rubbed off onto my hands so my hands were like bright purple and it's dyed all my nails a really funny colour of purple which is so annoying but hey how we're live and we learn. I'm getting ready for a redesign again, but it's not going to happen, is it? I literally dread doing my own. I put it off so long. Like you'll see in my videos, I put it off so long until they're literally hanging off. So now I don't know when they're going to get done again. So I'm now um, using my cover pink to blend down. Um, and just get that ombre in so the cover pink I'm using I don't know if I've told you about this cover pink before in any of my videos so if I have and I'm repeating myself I do apologise but it's from um, JA Nail Supplies and the colour is Exposed now this cover pink is everything I can't stress enough how fantastic this cover pink is I know a lot of you guys do listen to my recommendations and you do order a like obviously when you see me using it or you see me recommending it, this is stunning. Like it is beautiful. I've actually got it, um I've done an overlay on my nails with it and I just painted my white gel on, but look how beautiful that is in an ombre. It's so soft, so subtle, and you can see it in my French as well. Like it is so glass like, it's beautiful. Um so I will put the um the link below and I'll put the name of it and everything if you want to go and check it out because it's such good value as well I think um oh god I wish I could remember the prices now that's so annoying I can't but I think it's like a tenner for about 40 50 gram pot I can't remember which it is and they do a bigger pot which I think is 150 gram because I've just bought that one because all my clients have this color now literally all my like I'd probably say 90% of my clients have this um I think it's like 150 gram for about 22.99, I do believe. Um, but like I said, I'll link it so you guys can actually see it. It's absolutely amazing. Don't even buy the small pot. I'm not gonna lie. Just go straight to the 150 gram one because 
I used my small pot within a couple of weeks. It was, and obviously, like, I'm not back to back clients all day anymore. Um, but yeah, I used it in a couple of weeks, it was gone. <laughs> so just, just straight away get the big one. It's absolutely beautiful. And look, like, it's gone over every colour beautifully. Like, it's matched every single, um, every single colour flawlessly. It's so, so cute. And obviously, you'll see at the end anyway what it looks like on the finished set. <coughs> My my croaky voice again, obviously. I'm voiceovering at, let's see, 25 to 11. I can't do anything at a normal time like a normal person can. All the kiddies are tucked up in bed and I made voiceover videos as per usual. So once we've obviously done that, we're going to go in and we're going to cap the full set. I have really sped this up because, again, you don't need to see me cap, do you? Like, I've seen it a gazillion times. Quite a few people do ask me as well about the brush. Um, I have two brushes that I use um, and I love them both equally. So I love the Pro Impressions, I think it's a size 12, and the CLS um, brush. It's also a size 12, I do believe. Um, they are both really, really reasonable brushes. They aren't expensive. One thing I have learned is that you don't need to go out and buy a £40 brush. It's just not needed. Like, it really, really isn't. If you want a fancy brush, go and get one. If you want a brush that works and don't want to waste your money, go and grab one of these. Honestly, they're no more than 15 quid. I don't think, and they're perfect. They do me absolutely perfectly, so they will do you perfectly too. So then, obviously, we're going to finish file these, give them a top coat, pop them in the lamp and then as if by magic they're going to pop up on the screen in a second and you will see the finished set. So thank you so much for watching guys, I really appreciate it and hopefully I'll see you in the next one.